All right, Cigar Head crew, the time is here. I'm about to do the Cigar Head pick of the week. Y'all get ready. All right, Cigar Head Crew. Now, before we get started with the Cigar Pick of the Week, um, as you can see, I'm wearing purple because this is the month of October. By the time this video comes out, it should be November 1st. But before the month ends, I wanted to wear purple in honor of those who have survived and also lost their lives due to domestic violence. Um, domestic violence is still something that men and women struggle with every single day and it is so important to um to make sure that no matter what you go through that there's always someone to talk to never feel that you are alone and that you cannot make it through so i just want to give a moment of silence for those who have lost their lives and also for those honor those who have made it through domestic violence so if you please join me thank you so much for those who have joined me in the moment of silence for domestic violence all right cigar head crew we're about to get into the cigar head pick of the week all right guys so this is the the cigar head pick of the week is something that i want to do every sunday come out with a video of my cigar pick of the week um it may be a cigar that i've reviewed may have may not be a cigar that i've reviewed yet but um i feel that it was something it'll be something cool to do for the channel bring something fresh to the you know to the channel been thinking of new things to come up with and this is one of the things that i came up with so i'm pretty excited about it so we about to get into it all right cigar head crew now i want to give a huge huge gigantic shout out to Uncle Lee Mc912 because he sent me this cigar. He actually sent me a couple. And uh, when I first tried this cigar, it it was a wrap. I was I was kind of I was blown away. I've heard him talk about this cigar so many times and how he really really loved the cigar. This like it was one of his one of his favorite go-to cigars. So now the cigar pick of the week this week is the 1502 Ruby. Mm. hope you can see that all right guys now as you can see i'm a, i went ahead and took the cellophane off which let me show you guys the cellophane i don't know if you guys can see that color on the cellophane this cigar has been aging aging well now this is the 1502 ruby as you can see there's a closed foot on this cigar now this is the six and a half by 52 toro box press cigar torpedo all right, Cigar Head Crew. Now, the 1502 line was rolled at the Placencia factory and also the brand is under the house of Emilio. The owner is Enrique Sanchez and the tobaccos in here were, in, were harvested from Esteli and Jalapa. Now, this is an Ecuadorian wrapped cigar and the binder and filler are both Nicaragua. Also, if you want a box, I think they're a box of 20 and you can get them on globalpremiumcigars.com and you'll find a box of 20 will be $173. Well, I did a little research on the band, on the band of the cigar and the actual name of the brand because I really wanted to know exactly the history because I figured it was some history behind this brand of cigars and come to find out that uh, 1502, as you can see on the band, it says 1502. 1502 was, represents the year that Christopher Columbus arrived in Nicaragua. And also, I, do you see the symbol on the band? The symbol on the band represents the kingdom of Spain. Uh, this was there. This was, I think it it might still be the same, but that's exactly what that represents. Now, 1502 made their debut in 2012 at the IPCPR trade show. And the flavor profile on this is medium to full. Very, very good, very good tasting cigar. I'm not gonna give you guys the notes. 
you gotta wait for the review for that which the review will be dropping here pretty soon so you guys stay tuned for that overall guys this is a spectacular cigar very nice looking cigar if you guys can find it look on globalpremiumcigars.com gpc and you'll be able to find them and um there should be there's five there's five brands whether there's yeah there's five names under the brand right now and that is the emerald which i i had the emerald that was a pretty that, that was a much more milder smoke the medium full which is the ruby and the full body cigar is the black and gold and they also have the 1502 XO and they also have the 1502 Nicodacca. So those two cigars, I, I'm gonna get my hands on some here pretty soon. So if you guys get on globalpremiumcigars.com, you'll be able to find them there. All right guys, that's the Cigar Head Pick of the Week and I'll see you guys in the next review. All right y'all, I'll see y'all next Sunday for the next Pick of the Week. I'll holla at you.